everyone, Mike Sherry here with Paul Sherry Used Cars. Now here we recognize transparency builds trust. So we do video walk around reviews on all of our pre-owned vehicles, including this 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee in the altitude trim level. Now the altitude trim level is what some other companies call like the blacked out appearance package. So on the, the Jeeps, you're gonna get blacked out badging, 20 inch blacked out wheels, and you know your blacked out front grill and everything up here really looks good and then inside we've got some nice features i'll show you that's part of that package uh, i'm very familiar with this package as my wife drives one herself hers is a 2019 it's very nice vehicle to drive every day so this four-wheel drive does have the 3.6 liter in it this one's not hurt at all it's got under 30,000 miles it's very clean vehicle drives out really strong so let's go ahead and start the review I like to start looking at the front windshield up here for cracks and chips because I know that can be annoying and I don't see any, it looks good. So the Jeep badging, notice how it's blacked out and then around the seven slotted grill, all that is painted in the high gloss black, looks good against this black up here. Now it does have fog lights, headlights look nice and clear. Again, 20 inch blacked out wheels. What I like about these is wheels kind of turn black with brake dust over time. You gotta keep them constantly clean, especially those chrome ones. It's nice kind of having black ones. You don't have to, you don't have to take them to the car wash every other day, so that's nice. 20 inch uh, in size, wrapped in Bridgestone tires. Tires have a lot of life left in them, so not an expense you're gonna have anytime soon. And then your Grand Cherokee badging, again, is blacked out here painted backs of the mirrors kind of shows you when you're shopping for used cars if you notice the, the back of the mirrors is just plastic and not painted it's probably a cheaper trim level so uh it's got their sunroof up there exterior is just in really great shape handles the door handles are painted to match grand cherokees are a five passenger vehicle the seats are leather trimmed with a suede insert so suede is really nice because it breathes it's not super hot not super cold depending on the temperature it's very nice in the leather of course the durability and the trim makes for a really nice combination get your weather tech type matting down below it does have a 150 watt power outlet down here and air ducts everything really looks good on this doesn't it uh, got your backup camera backup wiper and then rear parking sensor so as you're backing up it's going to let you know as you get close to something uh, again four-wheel drive badging and jeep badging on the keyless entry you can lift that tailgate like i just did there's not a ghost that also has remote start panic unlock and lock what I really appreciate about the Grand Cherokee is you get a lot of cargo space without having to fold down any seats. Now that second row or back row does fold down if you need even more cargo space, but it's just nice having designated cargo space because quite frankly, we all got stuff. Easy access to the spare tire, got some nooks down here. I like these here. These are for where you, what I'd use them for, uh, is hook my plastic bags when I get done with the grocery. So that way the stuff stays in the bag. So that's nice. And then you got your sunshade here. This is going to keep your items out of eyesight from people peeking in. And, uh, you know, also keep the sun off of it. So that's kind of nice. And you can lower that with the key this entry, or there's also a button right inside the lift gate door there. For a black vehicle, this is in great shape. I don't see really any scratches. I'm sure there's a couple maybe minor ones I'm missing, but really great shape and looks looks really good take a peek inside here and then i want to show you something on the side mirror that i forgot it does have blind spot monitoring in the side mirror so that little triangle is going to light up in uh, orange color and then also it is electronic defrosting side mirror as well so if you live here in ohio like i do it comes handy a few months out of the year. Financing is available. That's another way where we're transparent, right? So uh, if you're interested in financing, you can actually just fill out your information on the link I'll put down below, and we'll send it to the banks and let you know what they say. So it's really simple. Uh, saves you a lot of time. You know, we work with probably 15 or 20 banks, uh, depending on your situation, and uh, we can do a lot of the legwork for you so you don't have to shop around, figure out what the best rate and term is. We can do all that for you. We've got people that do that every day. Uh, 28,518 miles on it, uh, leather wrapped steering wheel, it's nice to touch uh, and comfortable in the hands. We've got cruise control, hands-free connectivity, it does have automatic headlights so you just leave that on A and you never touch it again. Uh, 
you've got side mirrors that are power, one touch windows up front, power windows in the rear, and then power locks. Does have push button start, just gotta have the key in the ignition. Uh, it's got high gloss paint surround on around the radio vents and lower buttons here. The uh, radio is the 8.4 inch and it's a really nice color radio. I just put it in reverse so we'll check out the backup camera. And then it does have Sirius XM capabilities in addition to AM, FM. And then you've got factory navigation. There's climate control on here. And heated seats up front here and heated steering wheel up front. Now if you like buttons and knobs for the heat and air and radio, you do have them down here as well. Spots to plug in your phone, you can see the USBs down there and a 12 volt power as well as an aux port. Some oversized beverage holders, again automatic transmission. This is where I put my key. I don't believe key's got remote start. I don't know if I showed you that or not. I don't remember. But now you see it again, maybe. <laughs> uh, opening skylight does have the sunshade, so that makes it nice. Got your factory books in there, sunglass hut. This program's up here for your garage door, so you don't have to carry around those clunker remotes. And there's your skylight controls. Uh, I did pull this up, but I didn't look at it. But let's look at it now. So this is the history port. I, whenever you're buying a pre-owned vehicle, always recommend to get the history report for a couple reasons one to see if it's ever been in an accident two to make sure it's got a clear title that meaning it doesn't have salvage title or anything like that and that's what this auto check history report will do so uh the show's really good scores 96 uh if they've got title problems they score like a two you know so uh, this one scores awesome one owner no accidents no title issues so uh, really clean. We post those on our website so you can dig into that. Uh, but the gist of it is it's, it's all good. So if you like the way we are transparent in our selling process, just let me know down in the comments. I always like to see those. As always, thanks for hanging out with me. If you're looking for a clean Jeep Grand Cherokee, and if you've never drove one of these, come in and drive one. They're excellent. You know, we sell them brand new as well, uh, but they're excellent vehicles and uh, comfortable, safe, very versatile. Uh, very capable in all weather conditions. So thanks for hanging out with me, and uh, we'll hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.